you guys know, MTL Group is one of the largest textile players in sub-Saharan Africa. So yesterday our chairman went and signed a deal to take over Mulungushi Textile, which is based in Kabwe, central Zambia. So now we have five textile mills. So we're in Mozambique, we're in Tanzania, three textile mills, and now in Zambia. So we produce over 100 million meters of cloth. To put it in perspective, that's 100,000 kilometers of cloth. So that's uh, almost a couple of times around the world. Uh, I want to thank my friend Kennedy, who is uh, uh, no more with Barclays, who was the CEO of Barclays, and that's how the whole deal uh, initiated. Thank Mr. Mabuba, of course, thank Andre and the whole team. My friend from the credit, they always have to sign it. <laughs> Thank you very much. So the whole NBC team, I say, Asante, San, San, San. I want to thank METL. Um, I want to thank the vice president of METL Group. He's played a big, big role, fighting and fighting with NBC and making sure you know all our interests were covered. He's done a great job. I say Asante Sana. I want to recognize my younger brother, Hassan. He is the Director of Human Resources at MEPL Group. Uh, you know, we can't do without people. And officially, we are the largest employer in this country. We employ 24,000 people. We like to do businesses that employ people. We like to make money, but at the same time, like to do business that employ people. This country officially employs 500,000 people, out of which 24,000 METL employees, and we're very proud of it. That's almost 5% of formal employment in this country. Wow. Thank you, Hassan. Uh, I want to thank uh, the transaction team from METL, uh, from all those guys that prepared the whole, you know, with the banking, you know, you have to prepare the whole feasibility study, and the whole transaction team, I want to say thank you to all of you. I want to say thank you to Star Oil. Star Oil has done a brilliant job. Yeah. Maybe many a times, you know, I don't get a chance to say thank you because we're highly under pressure, always making revenues targets, sale targets, but I want to say thank you. We have a team that is young, very energetic, of course, besides our CEO. <laughs> uh, thank you, Mr. Nazir, but thank you to the team. Arvind, thank you to Vikash, thank you to Vinod. They've done a great job. I mean, imagine. business just a couple of years ago and today I'm proud to say this is a top three company in fuel. So you know you would hear the British Petroleum, the Reliance of India and then you hear Star Wars. Today Star Wars in terms of revenues this year will be the top three company. So I say congratulations. I think they're almost going to hit 300 million dollars of revenues. So congratulations.